small, prickly dinosaur discovered in South America reveals an unknown lineage. The small but well-protected dino reveals a whole line of dinosaurs that had gone unnoticed in South America. The newly discovered species, Jacopil caniocara, looks like a primitive relative of armored dinosaurs like Ankylosaurus or Stegosaurus, but it came from the Cretaceous, the last era of the dinosaurs, and lived between 97 million and 94 million years ago. That means a whole lineage of armored dinosaurs lived in the southern hemisphere but had gone completely undetected until now, paleontologists reported in a new study. J. Kaniokura weighed about as much as a house cat and had a row of protective spines running from its neck to its tail and probably grew to about 5 feet, 1.5 meters, long. It was a plant eater, with leaf-shaped teeth similar to those of Stegosaurus. Paleontologists at the Felix de Azara Natural History Foundation in Argentina uncovered a partial skeleton of a subadult J. Kaniokura in the Rio Negro province in northern Patagonia. The dinosaur likely walked upright and sported a short beak capable of delivering a strong bite. It probably would have been able to eat tough, woody vegetation, the researchers reported Thursday, August. 11, in the journal Nature Reports, opens in new tab. The new dinosaur joins Stegosaurus, Ankylosaurus and other armor-backed dinosaurs in a group called Theriophora. Most thyreophorans are known from the northern hemisphere, and the fossils from the earliest members of this group are found mostly in Jurassic period rocks from North America and Europe from about 201 million years ago to 163 million years ago. The discovery of J. Kaniokura shows that early thyreophorans had a much broader geographic distribution than previously thought, Felix de Azara Natural History Foundation paleontologists Facundo J. Regetti and Sebastian Apostigia and University of Pace Vasco paleontologist Xavier Peretta Suburbiola wrote in the new paper. It was also surprising that this ancient lineage of thyreophorans survived all the way into the late Cretaceous in South America, they added. In the Northern Hemisphere, these older types of thyreophorans seem to have gone extinct by the Middle Jurassic. On the southern supercontinent Gondwana, however, they apparently survived well into the Cretaceous. Later thyreophorans survived longer. Ankylosaurus, for example, went extinct with the rest of the non-avian dinosaurs 66 million years ago. The name Jacopil comes from a word meaning shield-bearer in the Polchian or Northern Tewelchian indigenous language of Argentina. Canicora comes from the words meaning crest and stone in the indigenous Mapudungan language. You can see what J. Caniocora might have looked like when it was alive, thanks to this computer simulation from Gabriel diaz Yantin, a Chilean paleoartist and paleontology student at Rio Negro National University. Originally published on Live Science. Image credit, Rigetti, F.J., Apostigia, S., and Paredes Suburbiola, X. Scientific Reports, 2022, licensed under a Creative Commons Attribution 4.0 International License.